What is up, everybody? New Japanese yen banknotes. Um, they were just released this month, so really, really happy. So because I live in Japan, I'm gonna try and get as many as I can. Really, really awesome. So when I have the time, I will make updates of the Japanese Yen banknotes presentation. So I managed to save eight um, banknotes from the current series. Um, maybe I'll save a little bit more. Um, lots of a thousand yen. Um, previous generations. 1984. This is the Serie D. And then 2000-year notes. Excuse me. Um, I have six of those. Serie C. 10,000 yen, two each. And I have five of these. And then 500 yen notes. Full set. Serie C. Series C and this is Series D 2000 and this one and Series E and Series F which is uh, this one right here. So yeah, Series F, Series E. And Serie B. I don't have, I only have two notes from Series B and Series A. Alright. And I also want to show you kind of just some. Um, so I use the front for British pounds. And um, so yeah, I like rearranging the album. It looks neat and uh, yeah, really happy with this arrangement, I guess. Um, so I got the British pounds, I have I put all the pounds sterling here. Jill Bratar, um, Ireland, Scotland, Scotland. So I did a bit of a, a, bit of a counting. <clears throat> so surprisingly, now I have like over a thousand pounds, like a thousand fifty or something. So that's really cool. Canada is. Um, I also spent really big on Canada this year because, yeah, I managed to get older notes and especially these ones. Look at that. Two hundred, two fifties, a twenty. A two, an extra two, or an extra one. So just missing the five and a ten. So many things I want to buy. Um, I think my next goal is to buy new albums. Um, I just want new albums. Australia, nothing's changed. Um, I really want to make updates to the Australian notes. Um, Euro, just got an extra fifty. Um, so. Yeah, really cool, really cool. And um, yeah, older notes, I want more. So yeah, I'm gonna see if I can get older Euro banknotes. And uh, yeah, a friend of mine got me an extra two zero Euro notes, really cool. New Zealand, um, I got an extra 20 here. So really, really nice. Yeah, they look really cool. New Zealand dollars. New Zealand dollars. Yeah. And then finished it off with uh, Swiss francs and Hong Kong dollars. 
So I show a lot of Hong Kong because I think in these past two years, I've spent crazy money on Hong Kong dollars. So just really, really awesome um, to look at really because they have like three different banks and they have so many different notes um, that they release every seven, eight years or so. So it's just really fun collecting Hong Kong notes. Um, I even go further with like um, having like extras, um, having doubles. So yeah, I think it's just really, really fascinating to look at. Yeah, as you can see, I've got doubles, right? Yeah, really, really fun. Um, and I'm really, really happy with the hard work that I've put in into my Hong Kong dollars collection. <laughs> so I think this this album is finished. So just to give you a little peek, um, this is, <laughs> I guess, my little office. But yeah. Um, thank you so much for watching guys, um, really really happy with collecting banknotes and uh, if you're a collector, keep on going. Um, this is basically 15 years worth of collection, it takes time, um, you gotta have a full time job, make sure you have some savings and then you build it up. So yeah, wow. I'm, Heart. This is basically the product of teaching, you know, because I became a teacher um, after I finished college and then I've just been teaching ever since and, and I started taking up this hobby. So <laughs> really amazing, really happy. So, All right. Thank you.